Rabia Mateo, who has always been passionate about beauty pageants and representing her province at international stage hope to bring forth another successful finish for Iloilo City. Rabia wasn't keen on posting the help she has given towards the City of Love, but she has somehow loosened up and has opened the things she has done to inspire people with social media. The diva who feels that being a beauty queen gives her the power and stage to advocate about the things individuals should take on especially during such tough times. She has been volunteering in Iloilo to help the frontliners and anyone who is need. After realizing the power to inspire others, she gradually opened her private world for people to see what she has been up to during this quarantine period. Maria Isabella Galeria is representing Sorsogon at the debut edition of Miss Universe Philippines to be held sometime later in the year where 51 stunning beauties are competing to win a chance of representing Philippines at Miss Universe 2020. An amalgamation of beauty with brains, Maria is definitely one of the strongest contenders to watch out for this year at the national contest. Not new to the pageant world as well, Maria participated in Miss Mandalayong 2019 pageant where she finished as the third runner-up before trying her luck in Bina Binning Pilipinas 2019 last year. At the national contest, she placed in the top 15 winning everyone's hearts. She knows the know-how of how pageants happen in the Philippines and has prepared herself well for the same. who also managed to make into the list of top four finalists of Miss World Philippines 2016, is now going to vie for the crown of Miss Universe Philippines 2020. Lamanan was also a part of Bina Binning Filipinas 2018, but was overrun by her good friend Catriona Gray who won the pageant. This Filipino beauty has made her comeback by competing in Miss Universe Filipinas 2020 and announced it with a social media post, Hello Universe, Team Lemonades is back. Sandra is a model by profession, 25 years of age and stands 175 centimeters tall. Being a fine arts graduate, she is a great artist with excellent creativity. Apart from modeling, she is fond of baking and hence is also a baker. Her experience in the field of modeling is of more than five years and she has learned to improve herself at every step. She strongly believes that being generous is the best way to show love, affection and respect to the universe and its adorable creations. Every day, she wants to be a better version of herself and has proved it in all these years. Can't give you here. Tell me what you're thinking. I need to know your feeling. If you can show me, you need to know my story. But don't get to cut. Paulina Malinx is an official representative of Bohol at Miss Universe Philippines 2020 pageant. Pauline is 24 years old and has earned her bachelor's degree in international studies, major in European studies at the Cebu Doctors University in Mandau City. Sebu and she currently works as a retail and sales consultant at CWC Interiors in Togwig. Pauline is no stranger to the pageant world as she was crowned Miss Bohol 2017 and Miss Chi Philippines 2017.
She also performed well at the finale night of Mutia and G Pilipinas 2018. While she competed in that also and she won two special awards named Mutangs and Institute and Miss Avon Fashion. Paulina Malinks was crowned Miss Global Beauty Queen Philippines 2018 during the grand finale of Mutia and G Pilipinas 2018 on the 16th of September 2018. Down, and I feel like I don't need you Here I am, falling down Deep inside, and I feel like I don't need you Maria Isabel Ismail has become the official representative of Paranaque for Miss Universe Philippines 2020 after she was confirmed at the red carpet presentation. The first edition of Miss Universe Philippines i.e. Miss Universe Philippines 2020 is all set to host its coronation on in Mall of Asia Arena, Bay City, Posse, Metro Manila. Miss Universe Philippines 2019 Gazini Ganados will crown her successor at the end of the finale. Isabella is a 24-year-old ballerina at Hampton Court Ballet. Bella graduated from the De La Salle University with a degree in psychology. She is a mix of Filipina, Spanish, and Lebanese. The diva is the granddaughter of former actress Marita Zobel and niece of the country's second Miss Universe Margarita Moran. Isabella Blanche Bella Roxas Ismail is an on and off vlogger who likes makeup, skincare and dressing up. She feels that beauty pageants are a perfect stage where she can voice out her opinions, and she likes to vlog about it too. To know my story, but don't get too close to me, cause I need my fantasy. Here I am, falling down, crashing down, and I feel like I don't need you. Here I am, falling down, deep inside, and I feel like I don't need you. Eliza Flormali now, representing the Davao City is 26 years old and stands 175 centimeters tall. She is a psychology graduate and now works as a professional model. She has been a very strong contender for the title and shows immense dedication towards winning it and representing the Philippines at Miss Universe 2020 stage. The beauty commenced her career in pageantry when she first joined Binabining Pilipinas 2015. But unfortunately, she could not secure her place in the pageant at that time and she did not return after that. Moreover, she was one of the Philippines' representatives for Asia's Next Top Model Season 4, but she bowed out of the regional modeling search and lost in Elite Model Look Asia. With hard work, desire to win and determination, Aleza participated in the first edition of Miss Universe Philippines 2020 and is already one of the fans' favorite. Under Aces and Queens camp, Michelle Gumabao has made it to the top 52 delegates competing for Miss Universe Philippines 2020. She is 27 years of age and stands 177 centimeters tall. Michelle graduated with a degree in marketing management from De La Salle University, where she was a consistent Dean's Lister and now works as a professional volleyball player and a TV presenter for ABS CBN Sports and Action. She is the daughter of former the player and actor Dennis Rolden and sighter of actor Marco Gumbau. Michelle Gumbau entered pageantry in 2018 when she became an official delegate in Bina Binning Pilipinas 2018. She was crowned as Bina Binning Pilipinas Globe 2018 and represented Philippines at Miss Global 2018.
Even though she didn't win the title of Miss Globe 2018, she placed at top 15 and was adjudged with the title of Miss Social Media and Dream Girl. Her experience will definitely be advantageous for her at the contest. I'm losing my mind, feeling that kind of love. I feel like a deep hole. Mm, will you give me something that I can give you here? Tell me what you're thinking. I need to know your feeling. If you can show me, you need to know my story. But don't get too close to me, cause I need my fantasy. Here I am. Falling down, crashing down 